to learn how to become a successful sportsman. It's really hard. I always wanted to prove myself and show my potential. Growing up in Qashqais, it's, it's really nice. All my friends are from here, been all over the world. I've seen amazing places, but yeah, uh, this, this one is my favorite one. When we're looking at the ocean, we're trying to understand how the waves are breaking, which turns we can fit on which type of waves. The turn I really like, it's called the carve. It's a really powerful move. You have to be really strong on your legs and, and on your core. Then you've got air turns, which are the most innovative turns in surfing. Then you've got the barrel, which is when you're inside a wave and you just disappear. Many times he didn't do that. In the beginning, he didn't understand very well how to do it. Everybody can be distracted for a moment. You think a lot about the results. For a result, you need to be focusing on the process. And you put him in the process, not in the result. Before comps, I just try not to look at my phone or Instagrams or Facebook, those kind of things that get your head thinking about something else. It's really important to know when to shut down and when to, you know, open up to the modern world. For doing something well is thinking about nothing. You get like automatic. You go with the flow. Nothing will stop him. The ocean can, can change real quick, so you, you gotta adapt yourself to, to the conditions. So you have a plan A, but if that's not working, you gotta jump into plan B and you know have something to you know in your head at least gives you hope. So you don't get frustrated or you don't give up because the hit is only finished when, when the horn blows. When you do a really good wife in competitions, try to, what did I do in the wife? And you can't remember. That's the feeling I get. You don't even remember the wife. You're just like, wow, that was amazing. You're just paddling back out and was like, what did I do? I don't know, but it felt amazing. My goals for this year would be to finish top 10 on the world tour. I finished 14 last year. And I love a challenge, so yeah. I don't know how it's going to go, but one thing I know, I'm going to work on it. Every time I'm learning how to shut down my head, leave all the, the modern life away and just work and don't give up. It's really tough, but when you get a good wife, your board's just feeling amazing and you're just performing at your best. That's why we train and that's why we surf, to get that feeling. I'm literally following my passion, my dream. It's unbelievable.